The if function takes three arguments. The first is a logical test, which must evaluate to true or false. If the logical test is true, the second argument is returned. If the logical test is false, the third argument is returned. Let's see some examples. The logical test is true. In fact, true is entered directly, so the second argument is returned. This is the same formula, except the third argument is an error. The error is ignored and the second argument is returned. This is unusual in Excel. Most functions cannot accommodate any errors. The logical test is false. In fact, false is entered directly, so the third argument is returned. When we enter the logical values true and false into formulas, we do not put them in quotation marks because they are not text. This formula determines the cooking style. The logical test tests whether the season is summer. Winter is not summer. The logical test evaluates to false, and the third argument, roast, is returned. The second argument, barbecue, is ignored. If the season was summer, the logical test should evaluate to true, and the result should be barbecue. This formula determines whether to go to work. The logical test uses the AND function. The first argument of the AND function tests whether the temperature is above negative 10 degrees. 35 is greater than negative 10, so the first argument of the AND function evaluates to true. The second argument of the AND function tests whether the temperature is less than 40 degrees. 35 is less than 40, so the second argument of the AND function evaluates to true. All the arguments of the AND function evaluate to true, so the AND function evaluates to true. The logical test is true, so the second argument of the IF function, yes, go to work, is returned. The third argument, no, stay home, is ignored. If the temperature was 45 degrees, the second argument of the AND function should return false. So the AND function which is the logical test, would return false, and the third argument of the if function would be returned. No, stay home. You can always check the help article in your instance of Excel. My channel includes a function overview video that provides practical information on finding and using functions generally, as well as videos introducing other commonly used functions. The excelfinancialmodeling.com website has more free resources. All the links are in the description. Thanks for watching.